The first week of the high school sports season in Bemidji has come and gone, but the cross-country squad has been putting in miles all summer long. Those long runs are crucial to make sure the team hits the ground running when the season starts. It's super important to build up our endurance and get ready for the season. We do like 10 mile Saturdays and lots of runs to get ready. Today was the team's annual two mile time trial, which creates a race-like atmosphere to break things up. Well, it's really good because we finally get to get our legs moving, get the tempo under our legs, and then when we have our first race, we'll be able to keep the same pace, hopefully. It's also a great way to gauge how the team is shaping up heading into the year. It was a solid effort out of both the boys and girls. Uh, I was very happy. Uh, it kind of shows what I was thinking, that the team is in pretty good shape. They've had a good summer, and I'm excited to see how the season's going to unfold for us. Nice, ladies! Today we did pretty good as a team, and we had a four guys up where we've never had before. For the boys team, it's all about depth and competition. Well, we have a really deep team this year. We have a lot of guys really close together uh, competing with each other, so it's going to be fun to watch how it all pans out. Well, we'd like to have a few of us in the top ten individually and definitely want to win the section championship. And for the girls, it's all about replacing strong graduated runners, including six-time state competitor Sadie Hamron. We've lost a few super fast people, but I think everyone's pushing this year to get faster. We have a few freshmen that are really stepping up their game, and it's really good to see them progress. They keep us going because we don't want them to catch us, so that's always good. And then we're always there just trying to lead the way, helping them get faster. They'll begin their season in just over a week at Shockey Strand Invitational at Moorhead. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.